Schmidt Rubin, 1889. Weighing in at 10.8 pounds with an overall length of 51.3 inches, this was the first in the Schmidt Rubin rifle series. To load up, we'll strip in two chargers, six rounds each of 7.5 Swiss GP90. Now we can either single load or elevate and therefore engage the magazine. Long, heavy, with an awkward balance point, it's not an easy hold, but keep up we shall, as working that straight pull action from the shoulder is best. It's all about the inertia with our cock on open. The two-stage trigger is smooth with a crisp break. The safety is similar to the Type 30. Pull back on the cocking ring and rotate till it drops into a channel. Towing it back out does take some strength. Our quadrant-style rear sights are huge with a T-tiny V-notch. The front is a simple barley corn, and as for recoil, not bad at all. Overall, this is a complex and unnecessarily long action rifle, and we'll see some major improvements as we make our way down the Schmidt family tree. If you'd like to know more, subscribe to see an arsenal.